I'm going to play a game of solitaire for American Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. If you are new to American Mahjong, there are links in the video description below to lesson playlists. It's a great game. It's a little different than most of the Mahjong versions, but it is just as strategic and complex and fun as all the others. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. All my tiles have been mixed and built into walls next to the risers. This way we can keep track of the progress of the game based on how many tiles are left for picking. I'm going to deal the tiles now. Player 1, also known as East will get 14 tiles. Players 2, 3, and 4, South, West, and North, respectively, will get 13 tiles. Then we're going to look at each player's hands, see where the strengths lie, pick out a category to focus on, and then we'll do the Charleston. After the Charleston, if you want, you can be the fifth player. Pause the video, assess all the hands, and decide who you think will win the game. Right your guess in the comment section below and include the reason why you think they'll win the game. Don't read any of the comments or you might be influenced. At the end of the video, we'll talk about it. Everybody has their tiles. Let's look and see what we can do for player one, also known as East. Couple jokers, flower, dragon, cracks, bams, pung of fours, dots. I would build around the fours. We could either play consecutive, one, two, three, four, there's even a hand right there. One, two, three, four, second hand down. We could also play evens. Two, four, six, eight. We need three tiles to pass. Let's focus on two suits. Maybe we can get an eight crack and a, yeah, eight crack. Actually, the two, four, six, eight, two suit hand, where the second suit is in the middle, this is the fourth hand down. We only need a pair of fours, so let's not do that. Let's focus on consecutive. One, two, three, four. As far as this dragon, the only way this dragon will be helpful is if we play like numbers with fours. We'll see what happens with that dragon. It's very risky to pass because it's a dual tile. It's used as a zero and a dragon. Let's see what we can do for player two, also known as South. We have a couple jokers, a flower, east, south, bams, cracks, dots, all singles, no multiples. What I see here is lots of ones, and we have a two nine. I think we should try for a year hand. Keep all the year tiles. And the year category does have one hand with news. Also, the wind and dragon category has a news hand with year tiles. Let's pass those three. Let's see what we can do for player three, also known as West. We have a flower, news with a pair, dragon, bams with a pair, dots and cracks. We do have some three, six, nine potential, four tiles. We have one multiple, and here we have wins. We do have east and west. There is a hand that uses number tiles, east and west with evens. These happen to be evens. East and west with evens is the fifth hand down. Let's focus on wins 
and keep the eights. Now here's the challenge. We have like numbers, sixes and threes. So let's pass those three. We'll focus on wins. Let's see what we can do for player four. West South Dragon, dots with a pair, five cracks and a three BM. We have more cracks than we do anything, but American Mahjong is not necessarily a game of suits. It's a game of multiples. Sometimes the hands are one suit, but it's really more about pairs, pungs, kongs, sometimes even quints. I think we should focus here. Six, seven, six, seven, eight, nine, or three, no, let's see, seven, seven, six, seven, eight, nine. Six, seven, eight, nine. We have no eights, but I believe they will come. We could also maybe do like numbers with sevens. So I think I would keep that dragon. Let's pass those three. Focus on six, seven, eight, nine, or like numbers with sevens and dragons. We're ready to do the Charleston. For the first pass, East passes to south, south to west, west to north, north to east. We got a keeper, two keepers. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I think that hand looks pretty good. One, two, three, four. Or we could maybe do something consecutive. If we get a five bam, we might even be able to play a quint with these jokers. One, two, three, four, three, four, five, two, three, four. Hmm. Let's risk passing that dragon. If we go for a quint, that will risk will be worth it. We got to get a five bam though. Year tiles, we got one. We got a year tile. We have two tiles to pass, so we have to whittle this down. We have a south and we have all the ones. We have a one nine. Our multiple is with the one. The concealed news hand would require these dots because that's where our multiple is. We need multiples with two zero one nine in one suit. So I think I would let go of either the two or the nine. The two is a little number, so it, it'll be a good pass as opposed to that. So let's keep the nine and pass the two. We'll focus on ones. If we can get a north, north and south with ones, fourth hand down, that has some potential there. If the year hand doesn't work out, We wanted eights and wins. That's a fine pass. We got a keeper, a six. Here we have some three, six, nine in here. Three, six, nine, six, nine, but that's a multiple. Six, seven is consecutive. I would stay there. There's a three though, three, six, nine. Six, nine, two multiples, two multiples, green dragon. Hmm. I think I would give up the south, keep the seven. I think I would focus on six, seven, eight, six, seven, eight, nine. Six, seven, six, seven. Let's give up the nine. It'd be nice if we can use those dragons. Like numbers with sixes or like numbers with sevens. We'll see. 
We're now going to go across east and west, north and south. We got the five, three, four, five, uh, Quint, first hand, maybe. We have two tiles to pass. Let's stick with one suit. We could always play three, four, five consecutive Kongs. That is the third hand down. Let's pass those three. Three, four, five consecutive Kongs or that Quint. We got a year tile and a South. Ugh, a South. Let's give up the nine. I'm kind of thinking we should play, go ahead and commit to news concealed. Ooh, that's really not very healthy. I almost want to play north and south, but we have a gap, no north. You know what we could do? We can give up the east. Focus on ones. If we get the north, we could play north and south with ones or like numbers with ones, or maybe even a year hand. We really only need one one or two ones. We can give up one one. The reason I say that is because there is a mixed suit. Oh, we need, we need the nine bam. Let's see, let's keep the ones. I was thinking of the first year hand, but we have a one, we need a nine, nine bam if we have 2019 in cracks. Cracks for 2019, one dot, and then we would need the nine bam, which we don't have. So let's focus on ones, maybe a year hand. Let's give up the east. Sometimes having jokers is a hindrance because we have two fewer tiles to pass. During the Charleston, having jokers can be difficult. After the Charleston though, they really help. We got a West. Maybe we could play a Quint with no jokers. Second hand down. Of course, eventually we'll need jokers. Let's pass those three. Oh, we got a seven and an eight. There, very good. Okay, six, seven, six, seven, six, seven, eight. Six, seven, eight with sevens in the middle, concealed. There are three hands we could play with these tiles. I think we can get rid of that nine now. We could maybe still do like numbers with sevens and use those dragons. Maybe use that as joker bait. If you wanna know more about joker bait, there are links in the video description below to some videos on how that works. Right now we may use that, but eventually we're gonna to have to make a decision. If we can get flowers, maybe we could play six, seven, six, seven, second from the bottom under consecutive run. We went to cross. Now we're going to do first left. No keepers. No keepers. No keepers. Keeper, seven. Okay, we have to make a choice. Six, seven, six, seven. Can we get flowers? I don't know. Six, seven, eight with sevens concealed. Let's give up the dragon. Ooh, there's a quint that uses sevens and the dragon. Crack, bam, dot. That's the fourth quint. We have no jokers. If we get even one flower, well, we're gonna need four flowers. 
let's focus on six, seven, eight concealed with sevens, even though we have a gap. We could also do six, seven, let's see, we could also do like numbers with sevens if we get that other seven. Since we have no flowers, hmm, no, let's give up the dragon. Oh my goodness, this is a hard one. Let's give up the six. Let's focus on six, seven, eight concealed or sevens with dragons quint with no jokers. <laughs> we have, let's see, this potential with no jokers and this potential with no jokers. We'll see if it works. We're on second left. Everybody has tiles to pass. We got a keeper. I think we should try for that quint. Pair, pong, kong, quint. We need, we need fives and sixes. We can pass those three. No keepers here unless we went with that year hand. Let's see here. We have lots of year tiles. Here we go. 2019, one, nine. 2019, one, nine. This would be the very first year hand. We, we're next to go across. We have to pass. We have this flower. Jokers. I would not, I would not discard these to try for the big year hand, the last singles and pairs hand. We have no white dragons. We need three. So I wouldn't play that. And we do have potential there. I think we should give up the south. Here we can pass that. Keep the one for potential like numbers with ones. Let's pass those three and focus on the first hand or like numbers with ones. No keepers. No keepers. We're going across. No keepers. We got a keeper. Okay, I think that solidifies it. Flowers. We need four. Two, zero, one, nine. Pung, pung. We need singles in here. If we can even get one, it'll be more comfortable. No keepers. We got a nine, six, seven, eight, nine, sevens. No, let's pass those. We're on last right. Everybody has three. keepers we got a two that is a number for a year tiles but I don't think we can use that I think I would break this up a little I think we have our hand here we got a keeper maybe east I think maybe east and west with eights or news concealed we have two tiles to pass. I would not pass the white dragon. I don't know if the risk is worth it. We'll see. We could potentially pass it, but I typically don't. No keepers. So now we are on optional cross. 
I wouldn't. I wouldn't pass. Oh, you know what? We don't pass blind. We have to negotiate. So let's say they want two. So this player passes two. So we'll pass these two. These two have three. No keepers. We got a one, two, one, nine, two, zero, one, nine. If the, if the, if the white dragon, well, either way we need white dragons, but if the nine bam doesn't come in, we have options with these tiles. So we're going to keep them. We'll discard those. Well, we got a keeper. Keeper. News. I think I would probably go ahead and give up these eights. Maybe use them as joker bait. Look in the video description for that. We'll hold it until about the middle of the third wall. Then we'll discard one. Maybe someone will make an exposure with a joker. And on our next turn, we'll use the second one to make an exchange. So we'll discard those and hold those as long as we can. No keepers. Well, no, wait, we do kind of have a keeper. We got the six back. If we get flowers, we could play six, seven, six, seven. Let's discard those. We're done with the Charleston. Pause the video. If you want to be that fifth player, decide who you think will win the game and write your guess in the comment section below include why you think they will win the game. I'll bet with this. Let's start by discarding year tiles. Nine dot. We'll use this to mark whose turn it is. We get a four. That's joker bait, maybe. Let's discard three dot. No keeper. You know, let's get rid of this white dragon right away. We don't need it. Three BM. Let's get rid of the wins. I usually throw wins, dragons, ones, and nines if I'm not using them. All the other number tiles are more likely to be used in exposures with jokers, so I hold them. It works a lot of the times. Let's draw. We don't need that. Your tile. We got a two. Okay, two, zero, one, nine. We have two multiples in here now. Two, zero, one, nine. Pung, Kong, Pung, Kong. It's still pretty light. I think what I would do is discard the four crack now. Let's get rid of three crack. Oh, green dragon. If we can get jokers, we could play that quint. Let's discard three bam. Without a joker, I wouldn't commit. Let's draw. Eight crack. Let's get rid of the nine bam. This hand is not ready for a nine bam. We could potentially take it with this, but we have nines here for 2019 and then one nine. Use this as joker bait later. So I would draw seven bam. Now no one wanted the four crack. Two crack, year tile. Two, 
two dot. We want big numbers, and that's a year tile. Red dragon, we don't need it. Flower. All right, now we have a pair in here. I would use this as joker bait and commit maybe to this hand. It's a little weak because we need a white dragon and a nine bam. I would consider maybe switching to like numbers with ones or like numbers with twos. Let's discard seven bam. That's not a keeper. That's not a keeper either, white dragon. Second one out. This player needs to seriously consider like numbers with ones or, or a different year hand, or we could pong. There's no hand that uses a pong. There's only one hand actually that uses a pong of dragons and we don't have any other dragons. That would be the wind and dragon hand second from the bottom. So I would not, I would just let it go and reconsider this hand. Let's draw West. This player is probably going to be playing the concealed hand. I wouldn't Kong because we can't Kong any other tiles. I'd rather stay concealed. We have all the Wests we need if we play the news concealed hand. So let's draw North. Nine bam. Your tiles are going down. Joker. Oh, Joker. Hey, maybe we could play that Quint. We have Joker bait. Let's get rid of the four dot. We might be able to play this Quint. We need sevens. Four dot. Eight dot. Five dot. East. Everybody's discarding wins, which sometimes is a good thing because you know nobody else wants them, but this is concealed. We're not calling for any tiles, and they're going down. I would stick with it, though. That was the last tile in the second wall. Everybody should know what category they're playing at a minimum. Here we're playing consecutive run, maybe a quint. We might. Nothing's really happening here for this. We might be able to switch to three, four, five Kongs. A three bam was thrown a while ago, but I was really hoping to play this quint so I didn't even think about it. So if we play three, four, five consecutive Kongs, we'll need to use a joker here. Here we're playing maybe a year hand, but year tiles are going down. I think maybe like numbers with ones. If we get another one, I would switch and then use these as joker bait. Or maybe switch to 2019 in one suit and use this as joker bait. Tough situation there. Here, news concealed, joker bait here. Here, potential quint or six, seven consecutive run if we can get flowers and then use this as joker bait. Seven, huh? Four, five, six, seven. That's going the wrong way. Let's discard three crack. Eight dot. Three dot. Okay, we need sevens or jokers. We got a six. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's get rid of eight dot. Okay. <laughs> six, seven, six, seven. 
We do not need pungs of all these numbers. This is getting a bit kooky. Okay. Red. Four dot. One dot. That's not helpful. This player's turn. They could Kong, but we have no other ones in multiples. They could Pung. If they Pung that one, they're committing to the first hand. And they have no White Dragon and no Nine Bam, and there are two each out. I would not do that. I would not do that. I'd rather use a joker or maybe draw well and maybe take it the next time around. Let's draw. Five crack. Oh, we got a keeper. Finally, pair, pung. No, we need twos. This needs to be Pair, Pung, Kong, Quint. We really didn't need that. Unless we switch to three, four, five Kongs, which probably will be a better use of these tiles. We'll see. Let's discard eight crack. North, no. Their winds are really going down. Three crack. I think they're too committed to change. Three bam. Too bad we don't have a two bam. We could do pair, pung, kong, quint. But even so, we couldn't take that two bam. Or the three bam, pair, pung, we could take the three bam. We could take it as a kong, actually. I think we should. Oh, let's see here. We could Kong, we have a Kong. We would only need one more five and a pair of flowers. Or we can hold out for the Quint. Pair, Pung, discard. Kong, Quint. We really have to decide right now. Kong, Kong, Kong. I think we should take it. Those are the wrong templates. Okay, I fixed that problem. Now, Kong. Do we Kong and downgrade from a Quint? Pair, Pung, Kong, Quint. I think we should downgrade. Let's Kong. This is Joker Bait. We'll discard this. Seven Bam. We got a one. All right. I think we should switch to like numbers with ones. The nine bams are down. We have no white dragons and there are two out. Let's discard two crack. We'll hold the two bam in case we get a nine bam and a white dragon. Two crack, nobody wants it. Five bam. They're not ready. Oh my goodness, look at that. 
I think we should go for this quint. It's going to be a long shot because we need seven dots. Let's throw six crack. One bam. Up here, let's Kong. Two crack. Oh, wow, look at that. We got an eight. If we had jokers, I might be tempted to play that quint. Let's discard six dot. And nobody wants it, so those are all going to be probably good discards. Eight crack. Two bam. Oh, we got the two bam. Too late now. Oh, bummer. Two bam. Oh, shoot. That's painful. Oops. Oh, one bam. We can exchange our own joker. Very nice. We'll throw two bam. That worked out. Nine crack. And nobody wants it. Those should be safe. White dragon. No, we don't need it. White, that's the third one out. Eight crack. Oh, we ended up getting that nine. Bam. Oh, my goodness. You never know in this game. Red. We need seven dots. We got a two, bam. Five dot, we need five bams. And a joker, because there's a five bam out now. Oh, that's nice. Oh, okay, this hand is one away from ready. We're gonna discard nine crack. They're looking pretty good now. That switch to ones was a good move. Oh my goodness, are you kidding? Look at that. Six crack. We're going to play a quint with no jokers, maybe. Seven bam. If we get flowers, we could play like numbers with sevens. We'll discard six dot. And nobody wants it. Two dot. We need ones. We got a white dragon. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my goodness. That year hand would have come in. Oh, geez. White. One crack. Kong. Ready to win on a one dot. We'll throw nine crack. And of course, everybody knows what we're playing. Six bam. And nobody wants it, so these are probably safe. Flower. All right, we got to seriously think about this quint situation. We need more sevens. Let's get rid of the six dot. We still have potential to switch to like numbers. Five crack, wrong suit. Five bam. They're not ready. They're gonna need another joker. Two dot. That was the last tile in the third wall. Everybody should decide if they wanna play to win or Switch to defense. We have two discards. I'd play to win, ready to win. This, I don't know. They might consider switching to defense. I would probably start throwing those. We have no jokers. We need a minimum of two, and we need four flowers. I think I would go ahead and give up on the quint. Focus on defense. This player between a quint 
and like numbers with sevens, I think I would play to win and try to get that quint and, and be as defensive as possible. Oh my goodness. We got it. Okay, we're gonna, let's get rid of this flower right now. Flower, 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 nobody wants it. Well, I think people want it, but they're not ready for it. So that was lucky. Oh my gosh, look, they got, they got a joker. Oh man, this game. Oh, all right, here we go. We need a one dot, six crack. All right, here we go. We need wins. Five, bam. Two were thrown, nobody wanted it, but now we're finally ready. Kong. And we'll discard. Ready to win on a flower. We need a one dot. Five dot. We need wins. We got one. Let's get rid of these bams. Eight bam. Nobody wants them. Safe discards. All right, we need a seven dot or more jokers. Eight crack. I think we should keep that seven. Let's draw. Nine dot. Okay, one dot or joker. Or a one crack or a five. No, the five bams are out. One crack or one dot or a joker. Seven dot. Seven dot. It's this player's turn, but here we can quint, and I would. We're going to quint. It's a risk. Seven bam. Six bam. Two bam. Three dot. One crack exchange, please. Thank you. Six dot. Ready to win on a seven crack. Exchange. No. We need a pair. We're going to let it go. Seven dot. Let the groaning begin. Eight dot. Three dot. Flower. I would throw it. We're playing a quint. Flower. Mahjong. Mahjong. Pair. Kong, Kong, Kong. Consecutive Kongs, third hand down. These players would pay 25. This player would pay 50. They were ready to win on that quint. Here, it sure looks pretty but we couldn't get them fast enough. Here, ready to win. That was a, wow, that was a tight game. Who did you bet on? Were you right? I bet on West. They had no gaps. This player had jokers. Even though they were losing out on those fives early, I think they got lucky. But that switch to downgrade from the quint was a smart move. Player one started out with a potential quint. Player four drew into a potential quint. Player three drew into a potential quint. Player two 
was stuck between year hand and like numbers. That was an amazing game and so many twists and turns and upgrades and downgrades. You gotta be flexible when you play American Mahjong. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next solitaire for American Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules, may all your picks be keepers.